Blessings everyone. Welcome to Rita Be Creative. Today, as we continue our do-it-yourself reupholstery series, Project 1, The Making of a Glam Throne Chair, I am excited to share with you the beautiful gold leaf treatment. If you miss any of the previous videos in this series, I will leave links to those videos in the iCard located at the top right hand corner of your screen as well as thumbnail links at the end of this video. Now let's get started with part 3 of project 1. The items used in this video are not sponsored. Check the description box for more information. The gold leaf comes in thin sheets sandwiched between tissue paper and is very fragile. Therefore, you must be gentle or it will rip apart. The glue adhesive has a very thin and milky consistency. I am applying a thin layer of glue. It should not be runny or leave puddles. Within a few minutes, the glue should become tacky when ready. 
The knuckle test, as seen here, works well to determine if the glue has become tacky. If so, it's time to apply the gold leaf. As you see, I am working in a large section. When new at gold leafing, you should start out using small sections until you get the hang of it. Now that my section is covered, all excess pieces are removed and saved to be used on smaller areas, which will be demonstrated shortly. The gilding brush is used to help smooth everything out. I will use cheesecloth to buff the surface. This is an example of how I use the excess pieces in smaller areas. Again, you see me doing the knuckle test and applying the gold leaf. If you find gaps, no worries. Just add a bit more glue over the area and add your gold leaf. The gold leaf will not be sealed until the very end of this project. I trust you are enjoying the journey of this glam chair coming together. Stay tuned for part four where the glam chair will be reupholstered. Let me know in the comment section if this video has been helpful and informative. If you're new to this channel, Click that red subscribe button and join the family as we head toward the goal of 1,000 subscribers by 2020. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you may be informed each time a new video is uploaded. Special shout out to all new subscribers. So excited you are here. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, be blessed.